in this video we will be discussing about uh, nifty metal index and uh, this would be the uh, positional view which i am uh, looking at so let's uh, look at the last uh, half a decade of uh, momentum which uh, the uh, metal index has shown so right from around uh, highs of around uh, 30 of 3500 in 2014 uh, index has seen a bad phase uh, slipping back to uh, nearly 1450 levels which was more than a half uh, or I would say 55-60 or 60% uh, fall uh, from its reset time in June 2014 uh, back to uh, uh, in fact 2016 it went to around 14-15 which was nearly uh, I would say around 2 uh, years fall uh, making index more than a half and uh, from there we have seen a steep uh, upside momentum uh, or I would say best outperforming sector uh, when the rally was between 2016 to 2018 uh, where it made a high of around uh, 3950 uh, uh, in uh, around I guess it was around January of 2018 or uh, start of 2018 uh, which was the best period for metal space uh, and even if you look at the metal space in uh, commodity space uh, that was the best time when all the metals uh, had uh, seen a good upside momentum but yes, uh, every good time uh, has a bad time as well. So again, uh, right if you look at the uh, the 2014 to 2016 fall, uh, we have seen a replica move off uh, from the uh, start of 2018 and uh, back to uh, now around four, uh, uh, around uh, 2200 levels uh, in August 2019. So uh, that's the uh, fall. If I look at the 2000 point, uh, maybe around 1900 to 2000 point in uh, 14 to 16, uh, and around uh, similar moves of around 1800 to 1900 points, uh, right from uh, August, uh, Jan 2018 to now August 2019. Uh, so which clearly marks uh, a equal moves, uh, or I would say in a harmonic pattern. There's a pattern called uh, reciprocal M equal to CD. Uh, which clearly defines that the move from A to B uh, on the point wise uh, is equal to point uh, C to D. Uh, most importantly, if I just look at this point uh, up and uh, look at the time uh, correlation, uh, surprisingly, uh, it was exactly around 85 months of fall or 86 months of fall uh, from A to B, which is uh, 2014 to 2016. Uh, and if I just look at uh, the 2018 to 2019 fall, it is again uh, around uh, 86 weeks of fall. So it's clearly uh, at the the both the equal weeks uh, as per the time cycle is uh, a sign of a good uh, end or I would say end of end uh, 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 of the bearish momentum and start of a new uptrend, uh, uptrend or I would say reversal uh, in a bad phase. So we are expe I'm expecting uh, this momentum for another couple of years uh, where Nifty Metals could again see a good upside and uh, probably we might see back to around 4000 levels uh, and if I just look at the current CMP it's around trading around 2700, 2800 and which is uh, if I look at the uh, price wise returns I'm expecting around 30 to 40 percent returns uh, from year on as well on Nifty Metals. So uh, this is the metal charts uh, which I have been discussing and uh, that is the metal, metals view on the positional side. But on the short term side, yes, uh, index is resisting around 200 days average. We might see slight uh, pullback in the uh, metal space where uh, around 2500 to 2600 can be tested on the downside. And that could be, I would say, a good opportunity to go long on metal space. Uh, so uh, for me, for the next two years, metal space remains a buy on dip strategy. And uh, uh, on the stock side, I think Tata Steel, Indalco and uh, JSW Steel plays well uh, from previous point of view. Thank you.